A man and three children are dead after an early morning house fire in Huntington. Now, we've been bringing you updates about this tragic event in the Rotary Park area of the city throughout the day as the story developed. Our 13 News reporter Lane Ball is there now with the latest. Lane, what can you tell us? Rob, we know that 30 year old Joseph Joseph Dante Caton was killed in the fire along with his three children. The third child's crew say the third child's body was discovered just before just before two o'clock this afternoon. One thing we learned about this tragedy, neighbors tried to help prevent it. I just walked down through there probably I'd say about five or five fifteen and I didn't see no flames or, or didn't see you know, smell anything or anything. Odessa May and her son Brandon Whiplin passed by the house on their way to visit another neighbor. Not long after somebody came in and said the house on fire called 911. So I ran up as the first one there and I dialed 911 and came running out with them. I seen flames in the back of the house and I knocked the window out and hollered in there and nobody said nothing. So I kicked the front door in and something was blocking. The man inside of the house was able to make it to the front door before collapsing. Some neighbors had already pulled one victim out of the fire. We drug them out and my buddy drug the guy on up to the road and I tried to get in the house because they said there's kids in there. We started just, I mean, beating on the house, uh, hollering, screaming, you know, get out, get out. When asked why they ran over to the burning structure. People might, you know, look at Huntington being bad or whatever, but we all stick together. When it comes to when it comes down to it. Rader says by the time the first units arrived, the house was already fully in flames. We risk our lives to save people in need. And in this uh, instance, uh, the fire had uh, too much of a head start on us. Because of the extensive damage, the body of the third child wasn't discovered until hours later. And Chief Rader says they may never know the cause because of that damage. Ina Huntington, Lane Ball, 13 News, working for you. Horrible story. Thank you, Lane.